Welcome back to Ramp Safety Course, Understanding Safety in Ground Handling Operations on Aircraft Stands. In this lecture, we are going to discuss the ramp safety aspects in aircraft docking. Aircraft docking is the first ramp operation and is the most important as later ground support operations depend upon correct aircraft docking. Aircraft docking is simply parking of the aircraft on the ramp. There are many prerequisites and safety checks performed before docking procedure is initiated. As soon as ETA of the arriving aircraft is passed onto the airport staff by air traffic controller, ramp agents carry out a thorough pre-flight inspection of the ramp. This inspection covers the entire center line from the aircraft stop bar to the taxi lane. The important checks for this inspection are that there must be no FOD on the ramp. FOD refers to foreign object debris or foreign object damage, that is, any object that is alien to the aircraft and can be a source of potential damage to it. And there must be no object such as any machine, equipment or vehicle in the aircraft safety envelope. All of the vehicles, machines and equipment that are to be used after arrival of the aircraft must be parked outside of the safety envelope. In short, the ramp must be clear of any object, big or small, when the aircraft arrives because such objects can do different types of damages to the aircraft. They can damage the aircraft tires. This is especially true for any sharp objects present on the aircraft stand that can dig into the tires if the aircraft runs over them. They can be ingested by the jet engines, causing mechanical damage to the jet engine fan and turbine blades. Or they can get hit by the aircraft jet blast and fly off to hit any other aircraft, building or piece of equipment. There are many different types of FOD you can expect on the ramp. For example, maybe some maintenance work was carried out on the ramp leaving behind some rivets or bolts. Or maybe during the previous ramp operation, the baggage handling guys were a little rough with handling passenger baggage and maybe some broken zip hook or damaged plastic piece of a trolley bag fell on the ramp. Maybe some vehicular accident took place on the ramp one or two days ago and some tiny fragments of broken glass are still laying on the ramp because they were overlooked by the airside management team who removed the accident wreckage. Maybe the rubberized layer of the Castro wheel of passenger boarding bridge was worn out and fell off during bridge movement in the last aircraft operation and is now laying on the ramp. Or maybe some ramp agent's key of his home or car was in his pocket that fell off while he was busy in his work on the ramp and now he is trying to find it everywhere not knowing that it is laying on the ramp. So there can be a multitude of possibilities and a large variety of unexpected objects you could find on the ramp in your pre-flight inspection. As you must have guessed, FOD comes from a source. And it is not just that you remove an FOD and carry on with your usual business, it is that you have to consider the potential and probable source of FOD that you are experiencing at your airport and take up the matter with concerned departments to make them aware of the problem you are observing. So for example, if you found a piece of tool laying on the ramp in your inspection, it must have come from some maintenance activity. That activity can be traced by airport management by checking the records of all the activities that have taken place on that aircraft stand and then matter can be taken up with a concerned department. It will make their maintenance staff aware to carry out a thorough inspection when they complete their maintenance work. These steps involving coordination and a spread of awareness for ramp safety are necessary for preventing FOD in the first place. 
as per ICAO, the surfaces of all movement areas, including pavements, runways, taxiways, and aprons, and adjacent areas shall be inspected and their conditions monitored regularly as part of an aerodrome preventive and corrective maintenance program with the objective of avoiding and eliminating any foreign object debris FOD that might cause damage to aircraft or impair the operation of aircraft systems.